What I'm going to create is poached haddock with a chili fried egg, garlic butter and panko crumb tulumi. Most people poach their smoked fish, it seems to me, and milk. What I like to do is poach it in a broth. All I've got in here is some water. I'm going to add some lemon. So I'm going to be using tarragon in the sauce, in the chili sauce. So I'm going to put a little bit of this in the liquid as well. Then my fish. What I'm going to do is just cut it into portions. Put that in skin side down. Put it on the pan. So bring it to a gentle simmer. Give it about five minutes. What I'm going to serve with this is halloumi cheese. So just slice it through. Put it into a bowl of water. Leave that for a good hour. Actually if you're in a hurry, slice it thinner. Put it in warm water. This is the cheese that I soaked earlier on. And what's happened is that a lot of the salt has come out. It's become a lot softer. Train it on a bit of paper. Bit of flour and an egg. And then breadcrumbs. And what I've chosen to use are Japanese panko crumbs. They produce these wonderful crumbs. And what's good about them is that they're quite coarse. They're not like leftover bits of bread that you've put in the food processor. Let's dip our cheese, coat it in the flour. The egg coats, sticks to the flour. And then we put that in the breadcrumbs. So we've got two bits of breadcrumbed halloumi. So before I cook the halloumi, I just want to check the fish, which should be ready. And what you're looking for is that it's just beginning to flake, nice and soft. Just put the lid on, keep it warm. Just put this pan on for my chili butter later on. So you just want to fry your halloumi in a bit of oil. I've chosen to use rapeseed. Drop your cheese in. So what you're wanting to do here is just cook it till it's nice and golden. Whoops, getting there. It's going to take about 90 seconds or so on each side, maybe a little bit more. Now I want to make chilli butter. Put the butter into a hot pan. Got about 150 grams of butter here. I'm just going to flip my halloumi over, nice and golden. Okay, now this chilli butter is wonderful, and the reason I think it's so good is you, you cook the butter to nut brown, bernoisette, which means nutty butter, really. Put in some chilli. Add the extra virgin olive oil off the heat. You don't want to cook it. Now we can take our halloumi out, dish, just keep this warm to one side, some parsley, a bit of tarragon, you can just strip the leaves off, give it a sizzle, so just take it off the heat, and now time to do the garlic egg. So slice your garlic, have that ready, a few spring onions, now you want to use extra virgin olive oil, get yourself your garlic. Sprinkle it in, cook it off, crack in your egg. Using a spoon, flick a bit of the hot oil over the egg just to help it cook. Get it over there. Sprinkle on your spring onions and that's ready to serve. Time to plate up. I'm going to start by putting my halloumi down first. So this is going to be nice and crunchy, gooey in the middle. Grab yourself a piece of haddock. Then our garlic egg. Chili butter. This is one of my all-time favourite brunch dishes, smoked haddock with crispy crumbed halloumi, garlic egg and chilli butter. It's absolutely fantastic and I just hope the people here in the market are going to appreciate it.